<laughs> Holy uh -oh. shit, he's going to the moon! <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so the Utah Raptors jump is just... <laughs> guys, it's so broken, we can go to the moon! We can seriously go to the moon! I've got so many clips to show you guys from last night with me and my friends hanging out and just... <laughs> trying to test the limits of this damn thing and like how high you can jump and where it can go and how far it can fall. Oh my god, it's crazy, dude. Like, it, it's absolutely crazy. Anyways, you guys, what's up? Today, we are playing the Isle. We are the friendly little Utah Raptor, but we will be a Carno very, very soon. I just wanted to mess- I, I, I was gonna get into this video and just be like, you know what? I wanna go ahead and I wanna- I wanna do Carno right away. But now I'm like, nah, nah. We got <laughs> you see the shit? Like, we can jump so freaking high. I wanted to mess around with the Utah Raptor more because it's incredibly fun now that you can jump. You can jump, like, anywhere and it doesn't matter. Like, holy shit, we can jump off mountains. We can jump to the moon. The moon is the limit, guys. That's the game plan anyways, you guys. First off, we need some water before we start doing some uh, extreme stunting and whatnot. Man, you can literally jump over other creatures like i'm probably gonna get myself killed before we even get the chance to go to the carnal like it's probably gonna happen because <laughs> my dumb ass doesn't know when to stop <laughs> anyways guys if you enjoy the aisle remember to leave a like it helps out a ton and i appreciate it an absolute dick ton and uh let's go get some water real quick before we um before we get into some shenanigans and whatnot oh yeah i hear something down there oh yeah and we gotta get Wata too, because we're dying of thirst. Well, we're not actually dying of thirst. We need some Wata. But the shit is that. Why are there so many things? We're on low stam too. That's the worst part about this. Maybe we can just jump down here and grab some Wata real quick. Uh, give me some of that good old H2O, good sir. Yes. Just check inside the water. Yeah, there's nothing down here. We're good. We're good? Alright. So, I heard some rumors about the Giga, and I don't know if the stats are true or not, but I have heard that apparently the Giga is going to do 20 bleed and 300 damage a bite. Uh, on top of that, there's a new ambush mechanic that's coming to the game pretty soon, which I think is freaking incredible. Like, I love the idea of it. I don't want to go over there because Spinos love to hide in... Is this one right here? It? Let's see. Hang on. Yeah, Spinos love to hide in this, by the way, guys. So be really careful at Marsh, because they love to ambush shit. <laughs> um, but there's going to be an ambush mechanic brought to the game really soon, which I'm super excited to see. I think it's going to be... Uh, it's going to be, like, detrimental to some creatures, because apparently the Giga, the Giga can out-sprint a, uh, a Carno when it uses the sprint mechanic, from what I've been hearing. Um, but at the same time... It's going to make stalking and hunting that much easier to do as a carnivore. And it's going to give you a huge advantage over, like, everything else. And and it's just going to... Like, there... People complain. And, like, I can understand the complaints. Don't get me wrong. I'm not ragging on people that are complaining. But people are complaining that, you know, herbivores are unbalanced. And this and that. But the game is not finished. All the mechanics that go to the game that help balance it out a little bit... To the tier, like to the point that it's supposed to be balanced. Like the game's not about being balanced or even or having fair fights. Um, nature isn't about that. It's not about you know. Oh well, we gave the Tyrannosaurus Rex bone breaking uh, bite force, so we'll give the Stego um, you know super hardened plates or something. It's not about that at all. But you know there has to be some balance to the game, obviously. And with the game in the state it is right now, early access, it's not complete. So there's going to be a lot of things that happen that aren't fair. And it, it would have been different if it was at full release. But those things have not been created yet. I, I feel like the developers are getting too much flack right now for quote-unquote unbi unbalanced gameplay because of the fact that the game isn't done. And I don't think it's really warranted. I'd understand entirely if this game was complete. But it's not complete. We have early access. We have the privilege as people to get to try out this amazing game before it's it's released. And I know we had to pay for this game, obviously. How else are they going to continue development? But I mean, they had the entire they had the right to say, "Hey, no, we're not going to let anyone play this game until it's uh, until it's complete to the point that we want it. We'll hire our own testers. We'll do all the we'll do all the coding and stuff, and then call it good." 
But I know you guys want to hear more about the uh, the pounce mechanic and all that stuff. So uh, it's an ambush mechanic. Sorry. Anyways, there are variables that you guys have to keep in mind when this gameplay mechanic comes to the game. So basically, if you're crouching, it's going to determine on how much or how long you've been crouched for. And obviously, you need to be crouched in order for this mechanic to come into play. And it's going to take some time for you to get your uh, get your bonuses to your speed and all that stuff. Um, but it's going to like determine how long your ambush will last and how fast your ambush speed is going to be. So that means like let's take the Spino for example. The Spino, it's it just crouches down for seven seconds. Let's just say this this is how long it has to be crouching. So you're sitting here waiting around at trips. Okay, I don't see anything yet. That's great. We've hit our seven second march. Uh, march well mark. And there's a trike coming. Okay, there's a trike there. It doesn't see me yet. And then when you start moving. You have 12 seconds of that ambush speed, so you're going to be running at super speed for like 12 seconds. Now, it's going to be like 120 to 140% increased movement speed, you know, and, and that's, that's, a, that's, an ex that's a significant increase to its speed compared to what its speed normally is. Take the Osteraptor. You crouch for 5 seconds, and then you have a 10 second ambush duration, and its, am and its ambush speed modifier might be like 150% or 200% or, or something just like... That gives it that little push it's going to need to ambush different prey. So just imagine being over over in this wooded area at at uh, at trips. Which, guys, I don't like the mapping that was put in here personally. That's my opinion. I I appreciate the gesture from the developer that did it. I definitely appreciate it. It's great to see that they wanted to do that, but. I think trips was uh, was better left untouched. I think we have it. It looks too much like center. Yeah, it looks too much like the connection to the server has been lost. That's why. <laughs> shit, I didn't realize it was a server restart. All right, so now I need to pay attention to Discord more to make sure I don't mess up when server restarts are coming. Let's just check down here again. Nothing down here. Let's go ahead, fill up our water once again. I feel like deja vu. Deja vu. Deja vu. Wow, I, I need to learn how to articulate words. I can't even articulate, articulate. What the hell? <laughs> Anyways, guys, um, where were we before we were rudely interrupted? Uh, oh yeah, that's right. We were talking about the ambush mechanics. So yeah, Osteraptor, all that fun stuff, stat modifiers, like 100% and stuff. Now, obvious, like, I think I was trying to explain something about trips. Oh yeah, um, imagine being at trips and you're able to, like, ambush the shit out of things as a larger creature. Like, let's say there's a friendly little Diablo running by. You're at trips. You're the Giganotosaurus. Well, what are you going to do? You're going to ambush the shit out of that Diablo. And, uh, yeah. Like, I think when it comes to ambushing prey right now, we don't really have the mechanics to do it. And I think I'm probably completely off track where I left off the video. <laughs> God damn it. But I think right now we don't really have the mechanics to do it. Like, we have fast... Uh, we have fast fast predators like this guy right here. What are you? What are you? What are you? What are you? Are you a Rex? I think you're a Rex. You can't chase me down. All right, we're good. We're going to keep on getting our stamina. But um, we don't really have the mechanics right now. We kind of have like... Please don't be a Carno. I, think, I can't tell if that's a Rex or a Carno. My monitor is like not... I think that's a Rex. Um, we don't really have the mechanic right now to ambush. Like, we have quote-unquote pouncing class and ambush pre uh, class and all that stuff, but we don't actually have, like, their, their abilities yet. We don't have what they're supposed to do as predators. Um, and obviously herbivores with their damage increase and health increase right now are a little bit strong. Uh, I will say a little bit, but, um, actually, I watched a trike kill four people. My phone's ringing! Can you let me record? Hey! You! Stop calling! I love being interrupted while I'm recording because I completely lose track of what I'm doing and uh, it's just a bad time. What are these guys doing? There's a Spino. Is that a berry? That's a berry. Oh, little guy's trying to get to Spino. Hey, little guys. How you doing? Yeah. We're gonna be friends. Not really. I'm not gonna get close enough to them at all so they can bite me, but... Because I'm pretty sure that berry's gonna need food. Um... <laughs> I always try and kill pathetic little berries, though, because, like, they... They need the points! They can't... They can't fend for themselves. They're weak as shit. <laughs> and again, I've seen some berries do some pretty decent damage. Anyways, before I was rudely interrupted, again, because I keep on getting interrupted, I... I'm, I can't remember where I was in the damn video. Okay, we're gonna move to something else. If this is something else, I don't know. I'm totally professional! I am a professional tuber of the U. Uh, let's say you're ambushing someone, and your ambush is 140% speed. 
You're gonna kill you're gonna consume 140% stamina. Now I feel like that stamina should be like 200 percent You should you should consume way more stamina because the boost that you're getting, while it should while it's like comparable to the stamina you'd be draining, the boost that you're getting in the gameplay mechanic should be like uh, multiplied because of the fact that you're getting such a big bonus, it should be multiplied again over to your stamina. So you don't want to, you know, waste that big bonus. I th I think that should be a thing. And uh, on top of that, I've been hearing that in the dev branch right now. If you check out the dev branch, uh, you have to delete your saved folder, I think, in order to do this. But if you're in the dev branch and uh, you play as something, if you hold Alt and then like A or D, apparently you turn really, really fast. I don't know if that's intended or if that's a bug. I have no idea. I haven't heard anything from Dondi about that. But um, apparently that's a thing. And I don't really like said thing because it opens, like, it, it'll stop ankle biting. It definitely will. Like, 100% it will stop ankle biting. But, like, it's not gonna really be a mechanic that's gonna be helpful to players that are hunting. Like, I think, I think it's gonna make things really, really difficult to kill. Hi, little Rexy. Mr. Mr. Rexy, is there anything under the water with you? Yeah, there's a Spino there. Is that Spino? Oh yeah, the Spino's there. I don't see anything else around, though. I, I think it's gonna be a really weird me gameplay mechanic. I think it's gonna be, like, if, if Shants can do that and they can just turn on a dime... I mean, like, if anything's behind them, well, it's gonna stomp their face and one-shot them. Instantly. Like, there's gonna be a bad time for you guys. It's gonna be a really bad time. The the, the the pounce mechanic and sprinting mechanic and stuff, though, and ambushing, that's gonna be cool as shit. I mean, it's, it's obviously gonna be cool. Either way, I think now is the time to show you guys some, uh, some extra clips that I had from last night about just jumping these incredible distances and shit. There's gonna be, like, a bunch of different jump cuts, but, like, the distances you can jump as a Utah are insane. They're ridiculous. Like, it is crazy as shit. <laughs> it is so broken. This is either a broken mechanic or it's working as intended, which is kind of scary. Look at this shit. You, you just boom. You're not going to break your ankles. You never break your ankles. I don't know how I managed. Like, I get the rarest achievement a couple a uh, couple months ago when I was playing as the Utah and I, I broke my leg. I, I actually broke my leg somehow. I'm amazed that I managed to do that. Either way, guys, let's view this footage. <laughs> oh my god, you're actually doing it. <laughs> oh my Holy shit. Oh, oh shit, I'm in. Holy shit. Oh my god. We good, boy. Okay. Ant, your turn. Go for oh, it. Oh god. Uh, Jump towards my this is gonna be bad. <laughs> just don't fall into this ditch. There's another ditch. Yeah, just, just jump towards my name. Jump towards oh my name. god. Ooh, boom. Woo! It's the double jump. <laughs> you guys both double jumped after. What the heck? Oh my god, there's a galley. What the fuck? <laughs> if you want it to go down. I'm gonna kill him, I'm gonna kill him, I'm gonna kill him. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> <He went up. laughs> Son of a bitch! Jeez, talk about death from above. <laughs> <laughs> there's a little galley. What the fuck? Is no spooky, watch out. Get it, get it, get it. Get that bitch. Get that bitch. Oh, he stopped. What the? Oh shit! Uh, uh. Yeah, no. Oh. Probably stay quiet if I have a broken leg. Oh my god! Little shit. Yeah. There we go. Eat it. it. <laughs> and was chasing. I just dropped down from up top. <laughs> <laughs> Holy uh -oh. shit! He's going to the moon. <laughs> <laughs> How are you still you alive? Were... What? what the hell? The bridge. Yeah, you, you fell like right through the bridge. That's weird how that happened. You... Um, wow, I can't believe you actually lived through oh, that. Oh shit! And oh, that's exactly what he did. Okay, I did the same thing and I broke my leg. <laughs> oh my how? god! This is so funny. You can literally <laughs> fall off right. of anything and not die. Ooh, 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 oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> you guys oh get like God. swallowed into the hole. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, prostitutes will do that. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> <laughs> you guys just like lagged in midair. Oh, that looks so weird. <laughs> <laughs> that looked really weird. <laughs> There's two of them. Get out! It might be Velocity and Kimmy. Uh, yeah. But yeah. no, Velocity was default. 
Or actually, he might be blue. Oh shit, I don't know. Oh! oh. Dude! <laughs> Whoa! Oh, he got bit, he got bit. Just keep running, Acro, he's, he's just dead. keep running. The colonel's run gonna like, die. To the left more, run to, run to the left more. Did he get bit? The colonel got bit, he's gonna go down. Yeah, oh, he shit. got bit. Yeah, he, he got bit. Sit down One bite, and if you keep on uh, running, they'll die. Yeah. Mm, damn. Oh, oh yeah, he's done, done for. Oh, oh shit. Dude, that was bad. Oh yeah, he's down. Oh rip. All right, that was all fine and dandy, but I'm walking through the ground now because apparently I'm the Antichrist. All right, so, oh shit, we got the worst freaking coordinate. Wow, we have 220 stam. That's more than I thought we'd have. I thought we had 150. No, that's the aloe. All right, so anyways, uh, welcome back from the little clips and snippets. Um, We're playing as the Carno now. I don't know if we're going to kill anything this episode, guys, because I don't think we're really going to need food. Uh, and with the time that I'm going to be playing now for recording and stuff, I don't know if, if we're going to need food, to be honest with you. Like, we'll probably kill something and eat it if it's, like, small, but I can't see me attacking anything large right now. But either way, we just progressed to the Carno. Obviously, we can't jump anymore, um, but we are si significantly better at combat now compared to our Utah friend, which is basically useless against larger creatures. Uh, we can basically ass bite everything, too. Like, we can, we have no collision right now. Now, I want to give you guys a fair heads up before we even get into this Carno gameplay, because I know a lot of people are going to do it. Guys, the Giga will be coming soon, and everyone is hyped. I'm hyped, you're hyped, your mom's hyped, your mom's mom is hyped, everyone and their mom is hyped and screaming about it right now. Um, the issue, guys, is that it's recommended that servers wipe when the get well when anything is really released it's recommended that the databases be wiped and i don't know if winter servers are going to do this or not i don't know if any servers are going to do this i know the official servers are supposed to wipe each time a new creature comes out and this is just to keep the infrastructure of that database solid and sound um i don't know if it's going to be a thing i really don't but it is recommended by dondi that servers get wiped with the release of a new creature. So, with that in mind, I want to give you guys a heads up because I don't want you to waste your time getting to Acro and then, you know, having to reprogress to Acro again because you thought you would be an Acro before, you know, the Giga came out. Um, I Again, guys, I don't know if servers are going to reset or not, but just be wary of it. Just, just know that, like, if you put that time in, there is a chance it's going to be wasted time to get to the acro unless you just want to play as the acro well then you know go for it obviously but i want to give you guys a heads up that's 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 my obligation i can't i can't say well i'm just not going to tell anyone i'm not going to do that so it is recommended be really cautious find out if your server host is going to reset the server or not before you prepare to get to giga um because obviously you don't want to waste that time getting to acro and then have to reprogress all the way back to acro with that said, I'm going to keep uh, running in this general... Uh, oh, that could have been bad. I'm going to keep running in this general direction, and uh, we're going to check a couple things out and probably end off the video. I'd imagine the ambushing uh, mechanic could also be used in defense, though. Like, if you're if you're just progressing, getting points, crouch down, just... Uh, come on, little guy, crouch down. There you go. Just crouch down. I don't know. Do you have to stay still? I bet you could move. And still gain that that ambush ability. I'm willing to bet you could. Okay, well, <laughs> anyways. Um, I wonder, like, you could probably use it as a defensive tactic. Just like, hey, there's someone behind me. They think they're going to get me. Now they're running up. They're running up. Nope, zoom. And you just take off like like a squirt of shit. And you, 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 you get away from all those that oppose you as the rightful king. I don't know what the shit I was doing. What did I just say? <laughs> All right. Anyways, um, let's keep uh, going. That's so weird. There's nothing. There's nothing around here at all. Huh? Even Trips is dead. <laughs> All right. Let's uh, let's move up here. I I heard huge stumps coming from like this area over here. I'm sure I did. I'm not crazy. Okay, I am slightly crazy, but I mean. You know, I, I don't think I'm crazy to the point where the voices in my head mimic sounds of stomping. <laughs> I don't think they mimic that either. Now, obviously, I wouldn't mess with the spinal because they have that turn radius that's just, like, ridiculous. They will turn on me instantly and give me a headache. I want to see, though, who else is here. 
Monsieur Smino, where are you? Right here. All right. <laughs> There's two of them. There has to be. I would argue that your your hearing. Oh shit! Look at that. I would argue that your uh, your hearing and ability to hear things in this game is infinitely more important than being able to see. I'm not scared of not being able to see people. I'm scared of not being able to hear them. Are these guys going to fight? Are they going to fight? Oh, shit. Oh, dude. The spider was going to get killed. <gasps> you better run away. Holy shit. The stego didn't want to take any shit from that guy. No. You stay this shit away from me. Oh my god, what are the odds of this? Why are you still running, dude? You gotta- You just stay this shit away from that- that stego. It's gonna make you bleed out so easily. Oh shit. He didn't even hit the stego. Are you serious? You're dead. You're dead, that's it. You've got too much bleed. You're- you're dead. That's- it. Wow. Are you- I- am I- I- I'm- am I seeing this right now? Oh yeah, look at that. Stego- Stego wants to finish him off. I don't want anything to do with that guy. Is the Stego done with him? Oh shit, he went down! <laughs> hey, Mr. Stego, I just want a bite. Can I have a bite? Hey man, I don't want to mess with your tail. I just, I just want a bite of food. That's all I want. All right, pretty clear we're not going to be able to uh, to get any of that food. Is this guy going to bite me? No, you're not? All right. You're not even worth killing. Yeah, Stego is not going to let me have any of that food at all. Oh, that's a tree. That's a tree. Yeah, not worth it. Not worth the risk. Screw that guy. He'll leave it. He'll leave that body. We'll go back to it later and we'll get it. But guys... I think I'm going to end this video right here. Um, I'm going to end on a final note uh, that's a little bit more of a personal one that I tried to keep away from YouTube, but I, it, I, I want transparency on this channel and I want to be open and honest with you guys uh, about anything that really happens in my life or, you know, videos that I'm making or games I'm planning to make or make, wow, record or anything I'm really planning to do. Because, you know, you guys are the driving force behind this channel. And uh, anyways, um... For the last month or so, you know, every now and again, every, every every so often in a video, I'd sound congested. I'd be like, oh, guys, I got the flu, you know, yada, yada, yada. And uh, I, d I don't want anyone to panic. Don't panic. I am I am 110% okay, guys. I'm I'm happy. Everything is great. But every now and again, I've said, you know, like, hey, I'm sick. And that's why I sound a little bit congested. Uh, about a month ago, um... My family doctor found a lump on my sinuses and he was like, you got to get, you got to get checked, dude. You got some weird shit going on up in that nasal cavity, man. I was like, ah, oh, oh no. I was like having meltdowns. I was Googling shit and like somehow it's weird. If you Google your symptoms of shit, like it always comes back to either A, pregnancy or B, cancer. So I was either pregnant or had cancer basically. And I was like losing my mind because I, I can't afford a child. <laughs> Ooh, I hear another spinal. You guys, you guys get the idea, though. Um, ooh, there's a Rex and a Sp- Oh, two Spinos! They're gonna mess that- They're gonna mess that guy up out there. We're gonna see that happen. But you guys- You guys get the idea. Don't wanna deal with that guy. Don't wanna deal with that guy at all. So for the last month, I've been hiding it. I didn't wanna, like, bring it up and be like, Guys, you know, this- And not have any answers for people. I didn't wanna do that. I didn't wanna make it, you know, about me and, like, Oh, worry about me and shit. That's the last thing I wanna do on YouTube. I'm, I'm here to make you guys- you know, laugh and, and have a fun, have a fun time watching my videos and shit. So, I mean, that was big for me. Um, and I, I had to, I had to, in essence, hide it from you guys. Cause like, I didn't want you guys to worry. And seriously, don't worry about it now. Everything's perfectly fine. Uh, I got to see my specialist yesterday and he was like, well, uh, you have something in your nose. We're not exactly sure what it is like on my sinuses, basically. But he's gonna basically, he said he's gonna burn it out or some shit now. Um, he said it's not cancer, it's definitely not cancer. It's just something that, that happens to people. Like, it happens, 
I don't know, it's, it's, it's more common like older people or some shit, but apparently for some reason I got the short straw, so they're like, hey, yeah, you get to uh, you get to have this weird thing going on with your sinuses that you need to get corrected surgically now. On top of that, apparently in the US it's like $10,000 to have this surgery done, but for Canada it's like, hey, you don't have to pay shit because uh, free healthcare. So, you know, uh, hurt my feelings all you want, I'll get them checked by a doctor for free, I don't even care. <laughs> but... I wanted to let you guys know, um, I made a Twitter post about it, and, like, the outreach of support, and, like, you guys, you know, saying it's gonna be okay, you're here for me and stuff, like, just so many people, like, I didn't, I, I, I went to one of my closest friends, and I was like, you know, I, I can't believe people actually give a damn about me like this, like, I just make videos, it's, that's it, I can't, it's, it's, it's not fathomable, I, I can't, I can't even articulate words that hit me that hard. And, you know, the realization that you guys do give a shit is, is like, wow, that's incredible. So many people, like, have my back, you know, and it made me realize I should have been open from the start and let you guys know, but I didn't want people to worry. I guess it's a little bit selfish on my part, um, but at least it wasn't worse, you know? Either way, guys, I'm going to be okay. Everything's perfectly fine in life. I'm happy. Uh, I have surgery in like two weeks, and it's a very, very minor surgery. Like, very, 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 very minor. I'm not worried about it at all, and uh, I'm just going to enjoy having ta or having fun doing videos and uh, doing what I do. There's that Stego over there. I wonder if I can bring attention to that guy. Oh, no, he's backing off from the body. That's fine. Yeah, I figured I'd let you guys know now and uh, let you know what's been happening. You know, I was reluctant at first, but... You know, at the end of the day, you guys are, like, a part of my everyday life, and you play a very big role in that. So, I, I think you deserve to know, uh, what's been going on. Yes. Haha, -ha, see? I told you. I told you I would get back here, and I would be eating Spino. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> but anyways, you guys, I'm gonna end this video right here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, remember to leave a like, it helps me out a ton, and I appreciate it an absolute dick ton. If you're new to the channel, why not consider subscribing? And I will see you in the next video.